virus hits vineyards in western india imports adversely affected vineyards in india's western pune have been hit by a deadly virus owing to which imports of grape plants have been adversely affected the viruses detected as leaf roll and rugose have reportedly come to india through imported varieties of grape plants the viruses have spread to various other varieties of plants in grape vines in and around pune और ये वायरस अगर ये वाइन ग्रेप्स के ऊपर आता है तो उसकी वजह से क्या होता है कि इनिशियल स्टेज में वो प्लांट जो है वो एकदम हॉलो हो जाता है और हॉलो होने की वजह से अंदर से वो हॉलो होने की वजह से वो पूरा सूख जाता है और सूखने के बाद वो पूरा प्लांट कोलेप्स हो जाता है Following the confirmation of such reports Pune based National Research Center for Grapes has advised grape cultivators to stop further imports of grape plants It has also been suggested that the infected grape vines should be completely destroyed at the earliest and replanted The sare scientists ne isar tarike kiya hai ki ye detect kiya hai jahan jahan hai pockets to kai kai jagah hame uski lagti hai ki yahan infection हुआ है संभावना भी है वो हमने फार्मर लोगों को बोला है कि जब नया प्रोपोगेशन के लिए ये इलाके का मटेरियल आप नहीं यूज करेंगे और हमने सारे फार्मर्स को अनुरोध किया है कि बाहर से अगर आप जाते हैं तो कोई किसी भी प्रकार का प्लांटिंग मटेरियल आप बिना क्वारंटाइन के देश में ना लाए एक्सपर्ट्स मेंटेन दैट द इंपोर्टेड वैरायटीज ऑफ प्लांट्स आर रिस्पांसिबल फॉर द स्प्रेड ऑफ द वायरस इन पुणे नासिक एंड अदर प्लेसेस इन द विसिनिटी According to official sources 94% of the country's wine production takes place in Maharashtra the virus is likely to affect the indian wine industry which is reportedly growing at a rate of 30 to 40% Pragya with Nida for ANI
Bhutto hails Musharraf's announcement of election schedule and Islamabad Supreme Court prepares for Musharraf election victory hearing. Pakistani opposition leader Benazir Bhutto hailed the announcement of election schedule as a positive step as she arrived in the city of Lahore ahead of a mass protest she is planning against President Pervez Musharraf's emergency rule. कि 15 नवंबर से ले करके हमें एक शेड्यूल दिया गया है और एक कट ऑफ डेट दिया गया है कि 9 जनवरी 9 जनवरी से पहले इलेक्शंस होंगे तो ये एक मस्बत कदम है सिचुएशन को डिफ्यूज करने के लिए मगर ये कहना कि इससे सिचुएशन डिफ्यूज हो गया है वो भी गलत होगा क्योंकि सूरत हाल बहुत बिगड़ी हुई है Pakistan's President Pervez Musharraf said on Sunday a general election would be held by January 9th, but under a state of emergency he imposed eight days ago. Musharraf, under pressure from rivals and Western allies to put nuclear-armed Pakistan back on the path to democracy, said the National Assembly and Provincial Assemblies would be dissolved in coming days upon completion of their terms. Meanwhile, Pakistan's Supreme Court is expected to resume the hearing into challenges against Musharraf's controversial election victory this week and could reach a decision by the weekend. Musharraf said he would step down as army chief and be sworn in as civilian president as soon as the Supreme Court ruled on the challenges to his election. Attorney General Malik Abdul Qayyum said the Supreme Court would most likely resume its hearing into the petitions challenging Musharraf's candidacy on November 15th. Hana with Nida for ANI.